Today, I want to show you a little bit about BitFocus Companion and how you can interface it with the Softron products. Now, there are a number of ways to control our software. There's our clean, concise GUI, there's the keyboard shortcuts, our Stream Deck integration, and our REST API that we support. An interesting way to control our software is called BitFocus Companion. They created software that connects broadcast equipment APIs to the Elgato Stream Deck. We have users who use this as part of their solution, but I want to say that even though this video shows you how to use their product with ours, we have no control over BitFocus Companion. So we, of course, will stand by our API implementation and our product, but can offer support specifically for BitFocus beyond the basic implementation. Uh, so with our applications running, you can access the API documentation at the local host, port number of application, and navigate to the API documentation. Now, I noticed that BitFocus was actually set to the same port number as one of our apps, so you can quickly change the port number here and hit change. Then you can launch the GUI and start adding the software IP addresses. Now, I've already added my software, but I'm going to add it again. So right here, let's click Add HTTP. Then we're going to label it and then the address. Now I've already added on-air video, movie recorder, M replay, and multicam logger. Now I can go into buttons. I have some buttons I've made already, but you can click the emulated button, then click set button type to regular button. Now you can find key down actions in the drop down for the Softron applications with their corresponding REST API call. So in this example, I'm adding a marker in M replay. I follow the API documentation to add a marker, then this body information, I'm actually copying and pasting directly from the API page, only changing the name value to say red foul dash home instead. With M replay open, you can click test actions button to confirm it is working. So I've built a few examples here, play on the air video, a start and stop recording on source one for movie recorder. I also have a button to start and stop logging on multicam logger. Uh, another nice feature here with BitFocus is the ability to stack the key down actions. So here I have a one button trigger to start logging on multicam and start recording on Movie Recorder. So there's a number of ways to use BitFocus along with our products. So if you want to find out more about our solutions or see what else Softron products can do, go to softron.tv. You can check out our knowledge base or you can drop us online through our contact support. Thanks.